She always said that, I'm okay, Mom, I'm okay. And I'm like, Phoenix, something's wrong. And I think I figured out what it is. Phoenix Colden, a 23-year-old woman in St. Louis, last seen December 18th, sitting in her car, talking on her cell phone one minute. The next minute, she's gone. Her car found running 17 miles away. There were three picture windows in the front of the house, uh, floor to ceiling. And I saw Phoenix when she backed out of the driveway and headed out of the subdivision and to my mind at the time, it was just she was going around to the store or maybe to a friend's house. Uh, it was unlike her not to say anything when she was leaving home. So, but I didn't think too much of it at the time. When the, when the truck was finally found. The truck was found the same day. Well. Think about it. They didn't know that and we didn't know it either. All the information about who owned the truck was in the truck. That was not the St. Louis County position, but the St. Louis Police position to notify. But they haven't. Today is two years, ten months, and one week since Phoenix left home. No one has no notified us that her car was found or towed or anything. Nobody. There was not much done. We were doing everything. We were printing up flyers and going around, passing out flyers in, in different areas of, um, of the city and in East St. Louis and so forth. There seemed to not be any more clues for the police to run down, so investigation seemed to just stop. I had a heart attack because of the stress another heart attack because of the stress and Lawrence gets after me all the time about you're going to give yourself another heart attack I'm like I'm not giving myself a heart attack I'm not trying but um, I just get so upset sometimes about the unfairness of this and why can't we get somebody to help us I just pray and pray and pray and pray and I don't try to make deals, you know, deals with, with God, but I just say if you, like little kids, if you, if you do this, I'll be good. <laughs> no, <laughs> I, I don't know. I just, um, what keeps me going? I, I just maybe tomorrow, maybe tonight. I look at that, looking at that tree, that Christmas tree, um, really gets me because she was supposed to put the tree up. She would probably make fun of my decoration. We waited until about two o'clock Christmas morning and she hadn't come home, so we decided to go ahead and put the tree up. People talk about Phoenix vanished, Phoenix disappeared, disappeared. People don't disappear. People don't vanish. People are taken and they are hidden. Some people hide themselves and that's not the case here. I think someone is hiding Phoenix for whatever their reason is. And we will find out what that reason is when Phoenix comes home. <laughs>